What happens when you put a bath bomb in a pitching machine? Let's talk about that. Good mythical morning. As a kid, I was terrified of pitching machines. It's got that wheel that moves so fast, man. And I, I was afraid it was gonna rip my coach's arm off and then I'd have to swing at his arm. Whoa, okay. And what if I miss? Can you imagine how embarrassing that'd be for me? If you miss the arm? Yeah. Yeah, that would be embarrassing. But probably not as embarrassing as the time I was trying to hit a cage pumpkin with a baseball bat and uh, lost my balance. And please do not cut to that. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure we just didn't cut to it. Yeah. And hopefully none of that happens today because we're gonna use a pitching machine to launch weird things at high speeds, none of which include a human arm or a caged pumpkin, I think. It's time for Putting Things in Things, Pitching Machine Edition. Welcome to our layer, the throw zone layer. Get it, throw zone, like ozone, but throw and a layer. Okay, what we're gonna do is we're gonna be putting things into this pitching machine that should not or have not maybe before been put into a pitching machine. Yeah, this is- Don't put your hand on it, come on, what? safety what? first, what? man. I'm, this is a safe spot to, don't make me nervous. Well, you're making me nervous. Well, this is a safe spot to put the hand. But why I do mean, you have to touch it the, at all? Not on the just, spinning, just Shut talk up. about it without touching, touching it. it. You're, you're making, making me nervous. nervous. I don't, I don't want, want your arm, arm to go through there. We're gonna ripped off like a coach. This is the first pitch baseline not a sponsor. It will launch stuff up to 70 miles an hour. Case in point, this is a baseball. Watch it go 70 miles per hour. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay. whoa, whoa, whoa. You see how I caught that grounder? That was like Little League, you see that? I caught it, it was like, it just came right back to me it's like to grounder. But we're not gonna do any more balls. That's stupid. Yeah. That's for baseball players. You know what and we're that's gonna do? Not us. We're gonna make not a tossed salad, but a pitched salad. Okay, the first thing you wanna do when you're making a salad is make a base layer of lettuce. Well, we've got all these bowls laid out here, and if either it's gonna spew across it or bounce off the backdrop, or I don't know, we haven't done this yet. Well, you're gonna have to little. battering ram that thing in there. Get it, lettuce! It's slowing down, it's about to cut off. Yep. All right, yeah, there. hey, look, right at you a bowl, man! <laughs> look at that! Look, I mean, what are the chances? Oh, I made one too! Can you believe that? I made one too! We should just quit while we're ahead. We just made salads, man. Job it, oh. Whoa, we did it again! What is it? Hold on. You don't seem impressed, Link. We've just done something that Michelangelo couldn't do. We we made three sal three for three salads, man. All right, now let's put some guacamole in there. Okay. Or whole avocados. All right, go for it. Oh yeah. Oh, I broke that. Oops, I broke something again. Oh. oh. Grab an onion. Oh my goodness. I mean, this is like a freaking softball. Yeah, 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 yeah. Whoa! Oh! Oh, 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 oh yeah! Oh! We're gonna, we're gonna send it over the wall. Oh! Oh, 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 here you go. Let me, let me do one. Whoa, oh, it, oh, it'll, no, I'm scared. It'll catch it, it'll, it'll catch get, it. Uh, it'll get it. Uh, oh. How about apples? <laughs> How about apples for How about your salad, huh? Oh, oh, wow, yeah, that's real nice. I think you could toss them from back here. Watch this. Oh, yeah? Oh, yeah, let me do that. <laughs> Why stop at apples when you can do peppers? Pepper time! Put it in like this. Oh, the peppers are giving nice distribution. Oh, you're getting pretty... <laughs> <laughs> Who eats raw potatoes in their salad? Oh, 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 what? what is that? It's mozzarella. Oh, oh yes! Everywhere, bits and bits. Did you, you see know that? You know what, I don't even care, man. I'm ready for this one. Nothing! You like blue cheese, right? No, <laughs> but you do. <laughs> I'm not getting blue cheese all over me. I'm Come gonna, on, man. I'm not gonna smell like blue cheese for the rest of the day. Whoa! Whoa! Yeah, oh, it's crumbling. I'm telling you. Oh! 
Oh! Boy, that wheel smells like cheese now. It's a cheese wheel. Link, I have a lot of little tomatoes. I don't know if these are... I really got to give some momentum here. <laughs> it didn't. Yeah, it didn't really amount to much, did it? And last but not least, another baseball. Oh, you man. know what? It seems like it was made to put a baseball in there. Yeah, you forget about the power associated with All it. All right, let's turn it off and let's find our favorite bowl. I got a bowl of nothing but blue cheese. I got a bowl of pepper and apple and a little bit of avocado. And I got a bowl of three chunks of cheese and then one little chunk of apple. There are restaurants in this town where this would pass for a salad. Like your neighborhood bar and grill? Is that what you're talking about? Uh, sink it? No, I mean like a fancy restaurant. And sink it. Yeah. Tastes like pigeon machine. I kind of like it. <laughs> Why bust a pinata with a baseball bat when you can bust a pinata by launching baseballs at it at 70 miles per hour? As you can see, we have suspended our Elmo pinata. He's saying hello or Maybe, Bye. <laughs> maybe help me. Okay, Link, there's only one way to approach a pinata, and that is a little bit dizzy and disoriented. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. We do not advise you to do this at home. Uh, whenever you approach a pitching machine at home, you should was that not... My, what, was that, I think that's my phone. You should not be dizzy. I, I got your phone. Everything's going to okay. be okay. Okay. Now, now, approach the pinata. I mean, approach the thing. Can you see it clearly? Yeah. Whoa, okay, a little bit low. I'm gonna Your get turn. I'm gonna get dizzy while you adjust that. Okay. Whoa. Whoa. Uh, uh. You get a ball. Drop the bat. Oh! <laughs> oh! He's not dead Whoa. yet. He's Whoa. just he just been tickled a little oh, bit. Oh yeah, he, he had a belly full of mashed potatoes. All right, I don't know if you knew this, but the, the model that we bought is not Tickle Me Elmo. It's Decapitate Me Elmo. Oh, okay, well, bring it up a little so bit. So let me, actually, yeah, I'm gonna get dizzy. You, would, you adjust it to go right for that noggin. Ready? Yeah. Do it. Do it, Neil. Right in his head. Oh, man, I'm really dizzy this time. Ah. Action! Tickled him so hard. Look at that. Right, leave, leave it up there, Link. Leave it up there. Let's 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 annihilate it some more while it's while it's there. I'm gonna throw this out there when you give me a count. Oh! <laughs> hey, I was a little close. Woo! You came into our parking lot, Elmo, and we tickled you to death. Take that, Sesame Street. I actually really love Sesame Street. Yeah, it's a great program. Those are, those are a special place in my heart. <laughs> You like coloring? Yeah. You like books? Yeah. Well, we got a mythical coloring book for yeah. adults of all ages. Yeah, it's so soothing. Get it at mythical.com. Yeah. Hey, Rhett, what? you ever wonder what it would be like to put baby doll heads into a pitching machine? Yeah. You ever wonder what it would be like to try to hit them with a mannequin leg? Yeah. Let's okay. do it. You want to go first? I'm going to go first because I'm not a good batter. But uh, you, have you ever batted baby heads with a leg? Nope. You might be great at this, Link. Now, because we're both delicate flowers, uh, we're very well protected. I'm dressed like a catcher. I'm dressed like a catcher and I'm pitching. I gotta take the gloves off. Why? The gloves are coming off, because they're too small. I can't grip the mannequin <laughs> lid. Here we go. Ah, you hit my elbow, man. Heads up, Neil. Oh, you hit my hand. Right where I took the glove off. Yeah, hey, hey, be ready, man. Hold Here we up. go. So it's a little inside. You want me to adjust it? it? That baby doll head was moaning as it came in. It made a sound like, oh, and I'm not exaggerating. All right, I moved it more to the middle, okay? Ready? Don't be so scared. Give me a countdown. All right. It's a little low, man. I'm exhausted. Oh, yeah, you made contact. What is that? Oh, hey! Grounder! I hit it. Grounder! 
I think, I, you got, I think you got thrown out. I'm too but... tired to celebrate. Okay, Rhett, your turn. And my advice is pace yourself. Remember Babe Ruth, Link? Okay, whatever. When he here, played here to the left field. A little high. A little low. <laughs> up. Up. A little low. Did it hit you? Yeah. Oh, that was, that was a strike, man. Oh, yeah. Did it hit you? That thing came so fast and touched my nose. It touched your nose? I mean, the baby's no, nose. No, it did. The baby's nose touched my nose. No, kissed, it did. I kissed it. Oh, reaching for it. Oh, yeah. grounder. Yeah. I hit, hit the, the camera. Hit the camera. Woo. Okay, now I've got toilet paper. And I've got a plunger. Here we go. Oh, wow, that was, that was, it was like a goose flying out. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, Link. Yeah. Yeah, that's in the strike zone. Yeah. Oh, sorry. All right. Did I inspire you? Oh, yeah. That line drive right into you... left field. Hole first. Yeah. Okay. Oh, yeah. Dude. Bring that it. A strike, man. Bring it. No, you whiff. Go. Yeah. yeah. Okay. I'll take a base. Here we go. <laughs> I aimed it at you. Whoa! Yes! I broke it! What the crap? I broke the Look. bat! Look at this! <laughs> I'm like Bo Jackson! <laughs> you see that? Woo! You see that? Oh, Am man. I too close? Am I too close to the camera? <laughs> Probably. Hey, I gotta give it to you, man. Woo! I'm not gonna high five somebody who just broke a plunger. Well, we got more to hit. Bath bombs. I got a baseball bat. I got bath bombs, y'all. Oh crap. I mean it's it's the same shape. And size is a baseball. Here we go. It's a little low. Oh, you had a little a puff that happened a back puff. there. A little puff. That puffed the magic dragon over here. Here we go. That, that was short. Oh. Yeah! yeah! Hey. Yeah! That was good contact. That was nice, right? Oh, yeah, that's good. Oh, oh, oh. Sometimes hey, the ball. Hey, hey. Sometimes the ball just. Particulates. I just get. Things get out of hand, man. Oh, that was a nice one. You like those noises I'm making when I'm swinging? Yeah, you sound like Monica Sellis. <sighs> Yo, oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, that was awesome. That Woo. was awesome. You made contact over here. Did I hit a lens? Morgan, you all right? Bombs away, Rhett. Oh, yeah. yeah. Nice. Yeah. Oh, another nice. Yeah! Take a base! <laughs> Woo! We Woo! did it! I'm gonna, I'm gonna break this bat on my knee! Yeah, ah, do no, it. I'm not! Don't do that! I'm, I'm gonna not break this bat bomb on your chest! <laughs> Give me another one! <laughs> that hurts more than it should! I'm gonna save these for my bath. Okay, good. Well, did you learn anything? Don't answer that! Thanks for subscribing and clicking that bell. You know what time it is. Hi, my name is Chris, and I am in a field of sunflowers. And it's time to spin the wheel of mythicality. Well, that's fitting because in Good Mythical More, we're gonna taste every flavor of Dave's sunflower seeds. Yeah! So click through to see where the wheel lands. <laughs> Color your way through the world of mythicality with the Mythical Coloring Book, available at mythical.com.